what you folks are talking about, the, the problem that you are looking at, is common across the state. Every school district that I work with struggles to figure out how they're going to keep up their existing facilities. So, I, I guess the, the, the point of that is you're not alone. This same conversation is going on in Fallon, in Minden, in Winnemucca, in White Pine. You know, all over the state, school districts are struggling with how do we keep our existing facilities. Well, that, does, that doesn't make it okay. Yeah. No, no, I understand that. I understand that. You know, but, let me give you an example. Uh, we have two legislative buildings. We have one built in 1969 and one built in 2001 or whatever we built. And I will tell you, as chairman of the Legislative Commission, uh, which oversees those facilities, we are in a constant, constant um, uh, refurbishing mode because our stuff, the 120 days we're in session every two years, absolutely destroys those buildings. The amount of people we put through there on a daily basis, they have to be done. We don't wait until somebody complains that the carpet in the legislature looks like hell because they tripped on it and sued us. We stay up on it. Is it costly? Yes, it is. But we plan for it. We budget for it. That is part of our process. If we have to give up something else, we have to do it. And it's not about making the place pretty. I mean, God, you've all been there. I mean, it's you, you compare it to other state buildings, uh, other state legislative uh, buildings in other states, and you'd be surprised how spartan it is. And that's fine. I mean, that, that's a decision the public wants us to make, and we do. But I can tell you, it still wears out. And we got a boiler that I probably is not quite as old as Glenn Duncan, and we and it's right in the middle of the building. We don't know what to do with it because it's it's old and, and and it needs to be replaced, and that that space needs to be used. But that doesn't make it right for us to just say, "Well, heck with it. We'll spend the money somewhere else." It means we've got to set up a mechanism, and schools aren't any different. And we do the same with all state buildings until they finally, we realize we built them wrong to start with and have to tear them down. There's some in Carson City that are that way, and they're going away. So that's the, that's the issue. Just because everybody does not doesn't make it right. And, and maybe this process will help those other counties. I think that would be greatly appreciated. 